All right, guys, here we're going to part one. All right, here we go. So we're going with the C major chord here. We're going to the D minor, the E minor, right? Going into the F major. Going back to C, going to the D major, right? And then over to G, right? Suits so four. Back over to C, a little bit extended there, to again D minor, then E minor, or C inversion, and then to the F, then we're descending back to D minor, and then E to the 6, which is A minor, the D minor, to G major, back to C. For those who watched on previous videos, that's the 3, 6, 2, 5, 1. We'll do that one more time. On the C, go to the D minor, E minor, to F, back over to C, to D major, right? Going to G. Then we're going back over to C. Again, walking up again to D minor, to E minor, to F back down E and then D again to E the three six is the A minor the two is the D minor the G is the five and then back to C is the one it's a very common progression make sure you guys get that going to the next part to D major as the transition to the G right <laughs> just getting that in there the G to the A minor, G inversion, and then to C major. And then E minor as a transition, F to D minor, to C, to G, Sus 4. As you can see in the notes there, and then A minor again, to the E minor. I'll show you a little bit of variation later on. Going to the F, again, that down walk to the D minor. Going to the three again, E minor. A minor is the six, the D minor is the two. The G is the five, add the Seuss four in there. And back to C, All right? Run through that again, All right? Going to the D major as the transition from verse to chorus. We have the G, Sus4, to the A minor, G inversion, to the C, to the E minor, to F, the D minor, and to the G major. All right, here's a little trick here again. So I'm just going B, A, A sharp, I'm sorry, A flat, to the A minor, E minor to the F, E minor, that transition there, that walk down to the D minor. Then again, our old favorite to the three chord E minor, six chord of A minor, two chord of D minor, to the five of G. And I'm just adding a little bit of a extra there. You can just end on the four, again, we're resolving the C. Again, D major is a transition to the five. to the C, F, to the D minor, to the G, so it's four, that same little lick again, to the A minor, and here's a little, little trick, we're going up a half step, to the B flat major, make it a little bit more eccentric, back to the F, that walk down, adding a little diminished in there, I'll do it again. D, I mean, so you got F to the E minor, take those two notes down a half step and then down a half step again to resolve the D minor. Then hit the three, six, two chord, five, and then to the one. Then we play that to get that uh, little transition there over and over again. And we'll just do it one more time. Full thing, follow along. 
The notes are right there as well. Added a lot for you guys, uh, just for your convenience. If it's not up there, then I apologize. It is a work in progress, um, so I hope it's up there right now. All right, going to the C. Walk up to D minor, E minor, and then F. Back down to D minor, hitting the three, six, two, five, one. Go into the D as the transition to G, to the A minor, G inversion, C, to F, go into the G, to that B flat major. again, half step, half step, and then to the A, I'm sorry, E minor, the three, A minor is the six, D minor is the two, G is the five, ending on that four, suspended, and then resolve it at the C. That is pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed this one.